YouTube, it's me, it's me, it's your favourite Steve. How you doing? Oh, and Lace. <laughs> Liam's over there. So, say hello, Liam. He's that little ball. <laughs> you want to say hello? Um, we've just come over the field to play some no! football. Um, yeah, I've been trying to do this like at least <gasps> once a day. Just to get my room and run about. You want to say hello? Hello! <laughs> Um, yeah. Oh, well, I'm knackered because I've just run onto the field. Try and do this at least once a day. <laughs> Take the ball off, yeah. Um, yeah. It's boring. I've been bored today. Can I take the camera? No, you can't. Because <laughs> what are you going to do? Film. Well, I'll let you film in a bit. Actually, I've been asking my. Well, my YouTube videos, it's my channel, it's not yours. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, that was rubbish. Um, to ask questions for Lacey, and we had a question from Lex. Do you know who Lex is? Uh, well, you can't see it on there. Yes. So the question no, was, what is your favourite part of your dad to hit? Huh? What's your favourite part of your dad to hit? Where do you like hitting me? The belly, because he's like, oh! <laughs> <laughs> why'd you like? Why'd you like it, me and Bella? Because you got like, oh, and I like you being, like you being hurt. <laughs> ah! <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Give me the camera. All right, you can take the camera for a bit. Hi, my dad's stupid, isn't he? <laughs> Pretend you didn't hear that. I'm bad at recording. Liam. Can say hello? Look. Yeah. Hello! I'm Liam and your name is Lucy and your <laughs> name is Daddy! Yeah, Dad's over there. Hey! Do not kick the ball at me! Show the intro. Yeah. What okay. up, little shoe? It's me, it's me, your favourite day. Love you, YouTube. It's me, it's your favourite day. We're just on a field. I don't harm him. It's just on a field. I go meet mommy. One. There's no harm for him. Go meet mommy. One. Yoink. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> and they was doing it disgusting. That was rude. I don't care. It's my channel. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> So yeah, I got my phone back. Hi. <laughs> she's not, she's not getting it back. Yes, I am. I don't know, what gibberish were you talking about? What were you saying? I was saying that you're stupid and I rule the channel now. Yeah, I like punching you in the belly as well. Hey, I like smacking you and punching you in the belly and kicking you in the belly Dance. and everything. <laughs> That's how old you are. Stop. So yeah, I hope that, I hope that um, answered your question um, from the young subscriber from Wales. Uh, if you've got any questions for Lacey that you want to ask Lacey, ah. comment down below for any questions for this little devil. Hi, I'm not a devil, I'm an angel. She's not, she's a devil. <laughs> so if you've got any questions, I'm a angel without if you've got any questions, let us know. But for now, I'll see you later. No. What up YouTube? How you doing? Just in the loft getting some stuff to pack up. Um, yeah, I had a pretty good experience with um, my Herms today. Uh, I haven't used Herms, Hermes, whatever, for the whole time I've been doing research. And I think I had a bad experience with, I mentioned it a few times, um, there was a lady who used to turn up in like a K8. And if you had any, if you had like, this is when I first started, so I didn't have loads of parcels over on. But if you had anything that was, like too big to refuse to pick it up and stuff like that and it just become a bit of a like, like a bit of a liability kind of thing um so i started using collect plus at my shop uh which i have no i've had no, no issues with a few breakages but nothing nothing too bad um but uh yeah so you start using them because of the you know what's going on at the minute and um yeah it's it just seemed it, it, it 
you know, but there's times where you're like, oh, I need to look into that. I need to look into that, and you don't do it. And kind of because of this all the shit that's going on at the minute, it's kind of made me have to look into other ways of, um, you know, sending my parcels. My local shop closed. It's open now, but I'm not sure if they're in collections. Um, and using my hands has been like a doddle. You know, what I mean, just printing the like. I got a, I got one of those um, thermal label printers. If I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but I ended up getting one. Um, and just printing off the my my Herms labels and Hermes labels, and it's just been a piss piss. Just been a piss piss. It's so much easier than um, going to the post office. Um, but uh, yeah, I I, I I was worried because I, I gave the guy like I think it was thirteen parcels today, and I thought he's gonna have an issue with this. Um, but he, like, because there's times when you get, I don't know, if, it, I think it's the same with all delivery drivers. When I was working at my old place, um, a lot of them moan and groan and stuff like that. So there's times when I've given big pies, oh bloody hell, it's gonna take up all the space in my car, that is. But what he started doing is because I'm giving him more, he started, um, because I'm giving him more, he started, um, coming in a bigger car. So he's obviously got two cars. So he started coming like as a family family estate. I think he was, I think he had a KA. He's like, not the Hermes drivers around near me having I mean, KAs. Um, but he's now coming like this family estate and he knows he's getting more parcels. And now he seems to be like, kind of, well, I'll get him. He's like, well, he's getting paid. I'm, I'm sure he gets paid per parcel that he picks up, pay an extra 50p to go and pick up. But it just seems a doddle getting him picked up. It's so much easier than me having to go to the post office. Um, but yeah, tomorrow I've got a load of wrestling figures that sold last night, um, which oh balls! I haven't booked the I haven't booked the my homes. Crap! I'm gonna have to go to the post office tomorrow. <laughs> Crap! I've just realised I haven't booked the my homes. It's pretty late now. Oh well, living there. Um, so I'm going to have to get some parts of this tomorrow with all my wrestling figures. I had a load of wrestling figures um, thingy on bids last night. Um, so I might show you them, I'm not sure. They, like the, some some sold where the bids went up and I ended up getting more money, but there's, the majority of them have sold just money back in my pocket. Do you know what I mean? What I paid for them. Um, obviously after fees, less. But um, yeah, at least it's making space and it? it's getting rid of some. Space in the lofts coming along as well, um, but yeah, it's sales are doing all right. I'm kind of on target for where I need to be. Um, I've kind of died down, but at the same time, I'm not feeding it. I'm not feeding it. I'll be honest. I'm, I haven't been consistently listing. Um, I've been sending lo lots of offers and stuff like that, but I haven't been consistently listing. Um, it's just after having the kids all day. I don't know how I did. I don't know how I. When I was working full time, credit to people, anybody who's working full time and doing eBay on the side, um, I used to be in that position and it used to be a thing of waking up at six, packing all my stuff up, getting the stuff out of the shed at six o'clock, getting it all ready, getting back from work, getting right on eBay. And now, like when the kids go to bed, I'm like, oh, God, be bothered. I'm going to sit down and chill. I'm going to sit down and chill before I start packing stuff up. Um, I mean, before I start listing and then I never get around to listing anything. But um, yeah, it's just me being lazy. I need to get back on it. I need to get back on it. But yeah, um, this ain't gonna be a full vlog, so I'll, I'll let it roll over. See you tomorrow. What up, YouTube? Uh, it is Daisy. Wednesday, Tuesday, something like that. Um, yeah, if I've mentioned before, uh, when I first started. Um, this is probably for new subscribers. When I first started, I used to sell um, a lot of Ben 10 WWE figures. Um, it was most of the things that I got. It was kind of the idea of when I was at work, I couldn't go sourcing. I could only go sourcing once a week. So I'd go sourcing on a Saturday to my local charity shops. And then um, I'd get bundles of wrestlers or Ben 10 to kind of fill... My listings and I did alright to be fair when I first started doing them. The Ben 10 hardly sell anymore. Um, 
WWE figures, I still get some sales every now and then, but these are ones that I've had, like, I was just going through it, I think these two are from the very first batch that I ever bought, so you're talking about in 2017, or was it, 20, was it 2017? I think it was 2017, so I bought those in like 2017, um, so they were in my first batch, so what I used to do was buy a job lot off eBay or Spock. And then I break them down into um, now I'd probably break them down singly, but back in the day I used to have this thing of not selling anything for less than I think it was six quid. Um, I wouldn't have anything on my eBay so for anything less than six quid. That's changed now. Um, so yeah, that was like from my first batch. Um, so these have been um, recently put on bids, and these all sold on. So you're talking about like some of these have been around for two years. Um, you put, you're looking at the back end of 2017 when I bought them, so, you know, two, close to three years um, that I've had some of these. Uh, so, yeah, they've been on, they went on bids the start of this month, or well, I think a few days in. And, um, yeah, I had like a load of bids end, I think I was talking about it on the video, I had loads of bids end um, on... I think it was Monday. Yeah, it was Monday, so I've got to pass these out today. So I had loads of bids end on Monday, and all these figures ended up going. So somebody bought a load of those bundles. Somebody bought a load of those. There's about three or four bundles in there, and three bundles in there, and then these are kind of separate bundles um, that are all going separately. But yeah, it's nice to get rid of them. It's nice to like see the back end of them. I've still got quite a few. I'll turn it around. So all these bags. If you ever seen the tub in the shed, there's one tub in my clouding shed that has um, like a tub of figures in. So it's all got WWE or Ben 10 or I think there's Lord of the Rings here somewhere. Um, there was the last Airbender figures in, in here somewhere, but I think they've all gone now. Um, but I will, you know, if I see, I know there's, because I did so many, I know there's certain Ben 10 that go for lots certain amounts of money, there's certain WWE that go for all my money, so I'll pick up them, I don't do job lots anymore and break them down, um, but yeah, that, the only thing I'd say, I'm a WWE fan, the only thing I'd say with WWE, it's like, I say a lot with this one, this one's a guy called Edge, um, he hasn't been around for like, um, man, I don't know, 11 years, but he's recently come back, so all of a sudden you'll have a sale for like a figure like him, because he hasn't been around for 11 years, and um, but then when you know, they, they make a reappearance, then someone goes, "Oh, I haven't got that figure. Or I haven't got a version of that figure. Right, I'll have a look." So I've like even not on bids, I've sold a few of him recently. Um, oh, what else was there? Or like they have like a year celebration thing where people um, get inducted to their thing called the Hall of Fame, and it's always old wrestlers, and you'd always find around that time of year. Um, certain ones will sell because oh it's come up in the mind of someone when they've been watching WWE oh I forgot about that wrestler right let's have a look on eBay see if I can get a figure on so yeah um you know I sell some of these weekly not that much anymore it used to be it used to be an everyday thing but you know I sell some of them weekly and it, I, I try and use up my um 300 bids up on these and other stuff that's been sitting around for a while Ooh, wasp. Um, so yeah, these are all going out today. I think it was a total of about 40, was it 48 quid in total? So yeah, it's worth the 48 quid to get rid of. Yeah, I've maybe lost profit on some of them, but it's still money in the pocket, ain't it? What up YouTube? Just um, on my way to the post office, balls up on these parcels. Don't know why, I think I'd, I'd sent all my parcels out on done all my parcels for yesterday and then just didn't register about the ones um but it's just went past I thought I'd be arrested didn't register the ones that would have ended on bids that day so I've never had to take a trip to the post office um they had social distancing in the last time I went so it shouldn't be a problem um I'm just surprised I've, this, this is the first time I've been out for like what I, first time I've been out for you know, about a week first time I've been like out of my avenue or the field next to my avenue um, for a while 
and um, there's a lot of people around. A lot of people around. I'm like, why are you at? You know what I mean? Like, it's weird, proper weird. But yeah, um, we'll see if they're still doing the queues outside the post office. Fingers crossed they are. What up, YouTube? How you doing? Um, it's late more in the day now. I tried to get some footage of the post office, but I ended up um, forgetting. <laughs> um, yeah, I just thought I'd put a bow in this vlog. Um, again, I'm having another late night watching YouTube videos, which I, I should watch reselling YouTube videos, but I'm not. I'm watching podcast reselling videos. Um, today, sales was been a bit pants. I had. One sale that has been paid for, and then another sale for a shirt. It's been really pants today. Um, hopefully it picks up. But I'm still, I'm still on target. I'm still on target from target. I'm not going to stress out. I'm not going to stress out yet. But you know, when you have a day with no sales, or barely any sales, it's a bit short, isn't it? And I've got a kid. So, I'm going to love you and leave you. Um, yeah, I've got kids, so I'm going to have to go and deal with that child. <sighs> Parenting life. So, um, yeah, I'm going to love you and leave you. Thank you very much for watching. Again, another vlog will have a place, but my idea is to just do clips, put them all together. I'm going to keep crying. I better go and sort them out. So, for now. Peace out, stay safe, stay beautiful, and I'll see you later.